contract is now complete. Uh, you agree to the terms, of course. Absolutely. You'll see, the million francs you are investing in my company will bring you a fortune. Really? In marrying my daughter, you will have the sweetest little girl. She is very charming. Uh, you're a lucky man. <laughs> uh, this is a big day for you, not only because of your marriage, uh, but because of the magnificent business deal I brought off, uh, you brought off with me. I shall try to make her happy. <laughs> but um, as you are both sailing to South America tomorrow, uh, don't you think it would save time if you signed the contract now? No, not now. But, uh, but uh, I have already told you, I will sign the contract and hand over the money after the wedding, not before. <laughs> yes, but do you doubt my word? Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Uh, only I thought that uh, a mere detail like this shouldn't be allowed to, to interfere with your happiness. No, that can wait. I have never broken my word, and I shall not do so this time. <laughs> oh, of course not. Uh, uh, you, you will drink a cognac with me. I want to drink to the health of the happy bridegroom. He is wishing you health, wealth, and happiness. And may you make my little girl very, very Well, you know what it is after a wedding, the fuss, the excitement. Uh, don't you think we might as well... Um, well? I was only thinking of you. You'll be wanting to be alone with Annette. <laughs> I'm never certain of Annette. She's very spoiled, I'm afraid. Ah, now what would you say if I were to tell you that... She is uh, gone, sir. What? Gone? Yes, sir. Look. <laughs> I can't tell you what happened to her, but... <laughs> Well, there it is. She's run away. <laughs> run away? What? You, uh, what? Uh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, no, no, please, please. Uh, uh, no, I'm sure there's some explanation of this. Uh, is it true? Is it true? No, 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 it's quite all right. Excuse me. Thank you. No, no, please, excuse me. I'm, uh, leave me for alone a minute. You please. Now, now, she can't have gone very far. Now, listen. I leave for South America in 24 hours. Well, she'll be here by then, I promise you. I'll scour the country. I'll search Paris. Rely upon it. She'll be back here in 24 hours. I'll use every means. Every means.
were trying to steal my bag. Steal? Absurd. Let me go. My bag is gone. I thought you had taken it. Oh, well, that's your excuse, because I caught you taking mine. So you think I'm a thief? Well. I tell you, my bag is gone. My ticket, my money. I haven't a penny. Oh, oh really? <laughs> that's new. How dare you? I'm sorry. Did it hurt much? No, not at all. Now then, young woman, you say you've lost your bag, your ticket, your money. You haven't a penny left. No. Oh, we must, uh, we must look into this. Attendant. Sir? Send the guard here, please. Yes, sir. No, no, please. Please, I mustn't. I don't fit in by anyone. Nobody must know where I am. Don't give me up. I beg of you. Then you are a thief. No, no, I, I'm not. I swear I'm not. You're running away from something. Yes. What? Prison? No. What then? Won't you tell me? No. Very well. Oh, God! Yes, sir? When <clears throat> do we get into Paris? Getting in now, sir. Thank you. Understand? I'm not going to let you go until I've heard the truth. I can't let you know the truth until another 24 hours. 24 hours? Well, that's not long to wait for the truth. Meanwhile, if you attempt to escape... Your case. You forgot it. Thank you. What are you doing in my car? You said I wasn't to escape. But you couldn't possibly have known this was my car. It was the best one there. Naturally, I said. It is his. Well, if you're a thief, I'm a fool. You could be a fool without my being a thief. That's very, very true. But I don't intend to be one. No. As soon as we get to the house, I shall telephone for the police.
Good evening, sir. Good evening. Good evening. Come in here. In there? In there. All I know is I'm hungry. I'm ready for dinner. Tell me. No. No? Give me the police. No. Either you tell me the truth, or I send for the police. I'm a runaway bride. My future husband is obliged to leave for South America in 24 hours. If I can keep away until 12 o'clock tomorrow, I'm safe. Very well, then. It's the police. No. Oh. Don't you believe it? Try the truth. See if I believe that. Very well. My bag was stolen from me on the train. A pig of a man pretended I was a thief. He's brought me here. And until I met him, I don't think there ever was a man I disliked more. There. Is that true? No. Oh, what am I to do? I daren't go out for fear of being caught. I dare stay in here for fear of being given up to the police. What would you do? <clears throat> Very well. You want to stay out of sight till 12 o'clock tomorrow. You've no money. No. No means of getting any. No. No friends. No. Nowhere to go. No. You make me cry in a minute. Then you must stay here. What do you say to that? Oh, thanks very much. This is a bachelor apartment. I'm not afraid of bachelors. Married men are the worst. There's only one spare room, next to mine. How inconvenient. Still, I mustn't complain, as it's only for one night. Mary. Mary, uh, prepare the spare room. Uh, the lady's staying the night. She didn't seem surprised. Why should she? Oh, perhaps she's used to it. How dare you? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I apologize. I'm terribly sorry. Please. You must behave. Yes. And remember, at noon tomorrow you prove your story. Otherwise, the police. At noon tomorrow. May I sit down till then? Yes, yes, yes. Thanks. May I? Yes, yes, certainly. Thanks. Even if we two should part tomorrow, our happiness today. Why should we admit a thought of sorrow? Let's take what comes our way. Dreaming I forget everything except that you are here with me. Gladly I surrender in your arms so tender, I'm content to be. I'll stay with you for just a while. I'll hear your voice and see your smile. We'll share our dreams and our two. I'll stay with you. You'll hold my hand, look 
in my eyes. I'll understand and sympathize. I'm all alone. You're lonely too. Oh, oh my. I'll stay with you with such contentment round me here. I find my troubles disappear. Right or wrong, who knows how long I'll stay with you. Good Lord! Stop that noise! Something. Mary. Mary. I've been thinking things over. Perhaps it's not right for you to stop here. <clears throat> oh, but I'd like to. Eh? No, no. I shall leave it to your conscience. If your conscience is clear, I've no right to keep you here. If you're guilty, well, give yourself up to the police. <laughs> There's a good girl. So now, if you'll go... No. Yes. It's not right for me to keep you here. Why? Is someone else coming? Well, yes. If you must know, it's my fiancé. <laughs> oh, please go. No. Please go. No. But please. No. I beg of you. No. no. I'll give you money. No. You can stay at a hotel until tomorrow morning. No. Oh, oh. the great Mussolini. You what, impertinent? You bring me here. You order me about. You judge, you condemn. And now all of a sudden, will you please go? But don't you understand? Oh. No. You've got to go. No. You brought me here, and here I stay. Yeah, but it's seven o'clock already. I know it. It's time for dinner. I can feel it. Yeah, no, no. It's her. Who? My fiancé. It, it, it's her. So that's your fiancé? Yes. There's no accounting for taste. You, you're going there at once. <laughs> Yes, but, but I thought you only had one spare room. You, how dare you? Please <laughs> go in there. No, you must go. You. I'm not going. <clears throat> There's another lady to see you. Yes, yes. Well, keep her outside for a minute, then show her in here. Understand? Understand? Now, please. Oh, but, but I want something to eat. You can't eat now. Oh, but I'm starving. Yeah, but, uh, oh, but I, you, no, no, please. Yeah, what are you up there? Well, it's well, Harry, you must sit. Now, you stay here and don't touch anything. Oh. Done. Well, why do you leave it there? Who brought us here? Oh. oh, give me this. Leave my things alone. I was only trying to help. Mac! Oh, Mac, darling. You're glad to see your baby. Mm. Oh, darling, it is nice to see you again. I thought that naughty train would never get me to my Maxie. Oh. Hmm? Oh, oh, I am 
so hungry. I haven't had a thing since lunch. Uh, let me help you. Mm. What's that? What, darling? That. Hmm? Good gracious. But how on earth? <laughs> <laughs> Mary, don't leave your this sort of thing about the room, please. <laughs> Thank you, darling. There, now sit down. Hungry? Daddy. Is it? Oh, my elbow, darling. I hurt it rather. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's nothing serious. What's that? That, uh, that must be the echo, darling. It's an old house, full of them. Oh, let's eat. Mm. Your cook is splendid. This is gorgeous. Mary, how often have I told you not to fidget about in here when I have a guest? We want the fish at once. At once! That's what I call service. Hmm. I'll answer it. Oh, it's all right, yeah? Allow me, dear. Oh, yes, Madame Duchesne. Yeah, let me answer, please. Yes, Mr. Max is here. Yes, I'm his fiancé. Everybody's dying to meet you and hear about your meeting with Max. Romantic rescue. <laughs> it must have been terribly exciting. <laughs> you are coming to our party tonight. Splendid. We're going to give him a great welcome. And you too. Madame Duchesne. She's expecting us at her party tonight. Oh, oh, yes. Yeah. Is she nice? A wife of the well-known judge. Rich? Very. Good. She seems to know all about our romance. <laughs> I mean, how you came to my rescue. Yes. Our first meeting, darling. Yes. Have some fish. It's no good you're doing that to me. I feel like that too. And I did so want to make a good impression on your rich friends. Mm -hmm. But they wouldn't let me have the coat for less than 50,000 francs. So it will have to wait. <clears throat> Besides, fur coats are only for really beautiful women, aren't they? Well, then it would certainly suit you, dear. Oh, darling. Mm -hmm. You do say the sweetest thing. Oh, my darling. Oh, oh. Oh, my darling. I'm so dreadfully sorry. What what have I done? Then it's just stupid me. Oh, no, it was all my fault. I'm so sorry. I know. Yes? I'll put it to dry in front of the fire. Oh, darling. Oh, oh I'll put on my coat. I'll get it for you. Oh, you poor darling. Come near the fire. I'll turn it on. Uh, thank you. There. Uh. Can I help you? No, darling. Can I turn around? Oh. Turn your head. Oh. Not looking? No, no, darling. But 
that? <laughs> that? Oh, that's a little surprise I've arranged for you. Oh, how delightful. <laughs> yes. It from here. Really? Yes. I don't like that tune, darling. Stop it, will you? Oh, don't you, dear? No. Well, stop. Yes. I'll, I'll stop it. I'll stop it. There's something wrong here. It should stop. Stop Let me explain here. Yes, yes. But, but I want to see all your nice That's Elaine, one of the maids. Oh, that's Elaine. <laughs> <Yes>. Charming room. <laughs> oh, there. Let's see the others. <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> that, that? That must be Therese, dear. Oh, that's Therese. <laughs> yes, dear. <laughs> this is a bachelor establishment, I suppose? Oh, yes, dear. <laughs> Darling. Who are you? Me. I'm the cook. <laughs> Must have jumped out. Now, where did that go to? How long has this affair been going on between you and your cook? Oh, you can't be serious. Mary, how often have I told you you must not bring your children into the kitchen? I'm sorry, sir. It wasn't Mother's fault. <laughs> <laughs> there, there, but it mustn't happen again. Do you expect me to believe that she's the... Yes. Is this your daughter? I am unmarried. <laughs> If you want <laughs> Your cook. Well, dear, well, practically my cook. Do listen to me. Oh, you... My you, dear, I can explain. Oh, so that's the kind of man you are. I thought there was something. And this is it. Oh, you... You creature. What's that? The whole world should hear of this. You're doing your best. You'll be quiet, darling. I oh, can't... don't touch me. Go away from me. No, I... Dear, it's Get out of my way, you monster! Darling, if you don't really listen to me... I never want to see you or speak to you again! No, no darling. Yeah. I'm staying at the hotel only! Yeah, yes, darling. Oh, but you... Won't. Oh, but... Uh... <laughs> Taxi! Taxi! What in heaven's name is there to laugh at? <laughs> I can't help it. <laughs> look, look, she's walked off into the night in her knickers. <sighs> Can you tell me the way to the Hotel Anglais? Eh? Can you tell me the way to the Hotel Anglais? Ooh, mademoiselle, oh. <laughs> oh, what fun for the boulevard. <laughs> My fiancé, what will people think? <laughs> They'll think she's everybody's fiancé. <laughs> Oh, you. So we two are left to grow old together. Are you really fond of her? What's that to you? <laughs> Nothing. How many more hours have I got to put up with you?
You put me up for another 15 hours. Heavens, I shall be ruined. I hope I shan't. What? Oh, <laughs> don't get nervous. I'm not as bad as all that. Your woman, from now on, you'll do no more damage. I'll lock you in your room and you'll stop there. Good. Only let me eat first. I'm starving. Oh, very well. Go on. Eat. <laughs> Wait. Go in there. In there? Yeah, no. <laughs> ah, still the same smiling face. Yes. <laughs> Where's that photograph you promised? Oh, 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 oh. Yes, oh, really, it's coming. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go oh, making up to me again. <laughs> Wait here. Wait here. I'll get rid of them. Yes. Well, yes. He's got a young lady with him. Oh. But that's what we want. Where is he? Yes, Max. Yes. Max. 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 There he is. <laughs> well, yeah. let's, here we are. Now we found you. Tell us all about your romance. Oh, my dear, there's no romance at all. Oh, yes. <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> well, p -p pardon me, I'm Jack. Yes? Yes. <laughs> oh, Max told me all about you. You're the girl from Milan. <laughs> Oh, if you want, uh, who are you? Oh, oh, uh, I am, uh, I am... Uh, uh, she I'm... is, <laughs> of course she would be. <laughs> uh, boy, boy, come on. Here, Alphonse, come on. Oh, oh, oh pa, 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 pardon me, <laughs> uh, 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 we've been celebrating. <laughs> oh, congratulations, she's charming. <laughs> Romantic story. <laughs> Night Errand to the Rescue. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what a delightful story. <laughs> shh, shh, boy. Max Fiance. I'll tell you all about it. You see, we knew you'd be back, so we arranged a party. What? Oh, what a party. Yes, and uh, you must come. <laughs> We're all going. I said, come on, change. No, no, yes. you three go on first. No, 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 I'll help you change. But I don't want to. Come on, come on. I think I'm marvelous, Barry. But I'm a party. I don't want to help you. No, don't brush me. Don't brush me. Don't need your help. I shall only be a moment. <laughs> I say, <laughs> lucky, Max. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, well. Well, here's a pretty thing. <laughs> and a very pretty thing. <laughs> and who is the owner of this very pretty thing? <laughs> Yours? Oh, oh, mine. My, yes, yes, yes. You see, um, I came uh, <laughs> from the station before going to the hotel, <laughs> and uh, when when Madame Duchesne rang up about the the party, yes, well, I I, uh, I thought I'd change here. <laughs> oh, good. Yes. Well, quick, quick, go, yes. go, go, go and change. You want go, to go, change? Go and dress, yes. Oh, I say. Yes. Go, go, can I help? What? Uh, you know. No, 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 thank you. Yeah, well, I should be much quicker by myself. Uh, I wish I, I'll alone. make you look beautiful. Max, there's what? a question I must ask you. What is it? Tell me, how did you meet your fiancé? Yes, I want to know that too. Yes, come on, tell oh, me the great story. Uh, accident. Accident? Uh, yes, we heard that, but how? I, I'd rather not talk about it. Oh, how beautiful. <laughs> That's charming. <laughs> yes, isn't it? <laughs> yes. Now, now, tell me the whole romantic story. How was it? What story? I hear you're meeting Max, how he rescued you. Oh, uh, accident. Yes, yes, I know, but how? Well, in the train. Huh? I mean, in the car. <laughs> but you said the train. Well, well, you see, there was a train standing by. Why? Oh, <laughs> trains do. Uh, well, if you must know, I rescued her in the Alps. Uh, the rope broke. 
So you see how it was? It is marvelous and romantic. Uh, what what car was it? Packard. Oh, you didn't say that just now. Oh, we're always changing. You see, father manufactures cars. Uh, what cars? Oh, Rolls. But your name is... My mother's name was Rolls. Oh, then you're Miss Royce. Yes, yes, that's right. <laughs> oh, and you drive Packard? I have an uncle Packard. Oh, well, I drive a Buick. Is that any relation? Distant. Don't waste any time. Now, give, give me my coat. I keep your coat. Don't be Where's my hair? Where, where's Jack? Why, he was here a moment ago. He's probably in there. In there? Yes, yes. let's go and see. Yeah, I don't want... Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> Splendid! Now we can go. Well, what do you think of our work? Doesn't he look wonderful? <laughs> Marvellous. Uh, come on, let's go. Yes, come on. Oh, well, how do we split up? Yeah, well, you three go on ahead. Yeah, I'll take her in my car. Yes, in, in my car. <laughs> oh, well, we can all go as far as the door together, can't we? Yes, yes jolly no, good idea. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> Marvellous story, the way he rescued her in the Alps. Alps? It was a burning car. Not what? at all, it was in the Alps. And the rope broke. Yes, didn't it, Max? Yes, certainly, the rope broke. Yes. Uh, why, rope Max? Broke. Why, because he was towing another car. What? In the Alps? Yes, and the train was standing by. Am I right? Uh, yes, well, come on, let's all go in his car. Yes. Yes. No, 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 you go ahead in his car. I'll follow in mine. Oh, no, no, come on, let's go. No, 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 no there isn't room for us all in that yes. car. We'll yes. come in my car. Oh, oh I tell you what, I know, we'll we, we race. You know, That's an idea. Yes. Yes. Come on. Yes. Yes. Come on. Yes. Come on. Yes. Now, you, uh, you go on ahead. Oh, no, no, you go ahead. Come on. Well, <laughs> don't, don't drive. <laughs> don't drive. Now, then, you follow us if you can. Oh, come on. In you get up. Now, you see what you've done. You ought to be very pleased. But she's my fiancée. Huh? What? I said huh, and I meant it. Every word of it. You don't seem to care. Why should I? I thought you said you wanted to keep dark. So I do. You don't. That story you told me was a lie. So you still think I'm a thief? I think you're a very dangerous woman, anyhow. Maybe, but not to you. Then I want to go to your rotten party and meet your silly friends. Is it any fun for me to be mistaken for that woman? A pink and white confection you picked off the house somewhere. Why didn't you leave her there? She'd keep better on ice. Silence! You will not go to the party. You will have a bad headache and you will go straight home. Will I? We'll my, see. My chauffeur will drive you straight home. He won't? Well, there's nowhere else for you to go. Don't bother about me. I know Paris as well as your quarter. I can go anywhere. I'm dressed. More than she is anywhere. Don't bother. I can amuse myself. But damn it, woman, you don't know what might happen to a girl in Paris at this hour. No, but I've often wondered. So perhaps now I'll find out. <laughs> Don't stop here. Back up to the car park. Yes, sir. What are you doing? Now, you're going to remain here. I'm not going to let you loose again. I have a moral responsibility to the public. Now, you stay there. I won't! You will! Now, on no account let the lady out. You understand? Yes, sir.
I'll stay with you an hour or two So you can yell until you're blue Smash up the seat, the windows too I'll stay with you You're like a bird inside a cage You can't be heard, so show your rage The whole night through, I'll speak like you I'll stay with you his arm. She's got out of my car. I got out of yours? Yes. Oh! oh. Yeah. He must be drunk. What, me? Where's your license? Oh, she's got it. I've got it? Yes. Oh. Oh. oh, what did I tell you? Get back to your car. Not unless she goes with me. Very well, then you come along with me. Yes, but she I tell you... Never she's... mind. But she's got... You're coming along. Yes, but... Yes, but I tell you she's got... It doesn't yes. matter. Oh, what a... Come on. Yes. Look, it's too complicated. Now, look at this and this. No, no lobster. Oh, do you know what that is? No. Yeah, neither do I. Next. Yes? Next, your fiancé has arrived after all. What? My fiancé's here? Yes, she's charming. Everyone's dying to meet Excuse me, will you please? Please excuse me. No, no, wait. Now, listen. Don't, don't, don't talk to me for a minute. Let me concentrate heavily on this, and I'll give you the most marvellous cold meal you've ever had in your life.
You must go at once. No. Yes. She's here. No. Yes. She's here. I won't have it. Why, people who matter most in the world to me are here tonight. Thank you. It's outrageous. Outrageous, Junior. Well, of course, dear. If you feel your mother's ill and needs you, you must go. Oh, come on, Max. Hmm? They want to see the rescuer and the rescue. Yes, come on. <laughs> So conspicuous. I can't help it. You will keep quiet, out of sight. Then don't. No. Then think. You're wanted on the phone, sir. I can't come now. A lady, sir. Hello. Hello, is that you, Max? Well, aren't you ashamed of yourself? No, not at all. If you believe these things about me very well, I've no more to say. What is married life without confidence? No. No, you've hurt me too deeply for that. What? No, I will not. Tomorrow, perhaps. But now, no. No. I know. Let's make her sing. It's sure to be jolly. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
looking for you. You're looking for me. We met in a flash. Both had to crash. Or do you see? But I made a great for You're so unique. I'm afraid for. I feel so weak. I'm looking for you. You're looking for me. It's just like a spark seen in the dark. Don't you agree? I'm simply mad yet. Glad this had to be. You are the one for me. Are you very angry? Want to dance with me? Dance. Still want to think? Oh, hold me tighter! I'm not a dummy. The Missing Bride. There is no news yet of Mademoiselle Annette Marquand, who disappeared from her home a few hours before her marriage. It is thought she has come to Paris. We are asked by the Prefect of Police to broadcast the following description. Medium height. Slim, athletic figure. Dark hair with small fringe. Large brown eyes. And, so we are given to understand, a charming, retrousse nose. Any information as to her whereabouts should be communicated to the nearest police station. <laughs> goodbye. 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 Where are you going? I'm going to find that girl. A girl like that, it isn't safe to be alone at this time of night. I, I, I won't be long. <laughs> Come on, everybody. It's so dreadful. I don't like to do that. Such a shame to spoil everybody's pleasure, making an arrest here. It's no good. You must tell everybody at once. No, no. I'll take charge. Send for the police immediately. Telephone them to report to me directly they come. Very well. I may manage without them. Come with me. Ladies and gentlemen, please. Ladies and gentlemen, a serious affair has occurred. A robbery has taken place. Madame Duchesne's famous pearls are missing. No one must leave this room until they are found. Madame Duchesne wishes to give the, the thief every chance to replace them. It may be only a stupid joke. In case it is, I will put this plate here. The lights will then be turned out for a few seconds, and during that time, the necklace must be replaced. I think that will be the best way to settle this. Lights, please. Yes, sir. Did you take them? No. <laughs> Are you sure? Yes. Oh! Lights. Very well, then. I regret it, but there is another way. 
The identity of everyone must be established and everybody must be searched. Did you do it? If you did, tell me, and I'll get you out of it somehow. Why? Well, because... Oh, nothing. Only if you took them, tell me. Give them to me. Every door is guarded, and nobody must leave the house. You're rather a dear, but I can't stop now. One moment, please. No one's allowed to leave. Please step this way. This gentleman was trying to leave the house, sir. Now? Have you been searched? Certainly not. Very well, then. You must be searched. Oh, ridiculous. What's this? <coughs> that. <laughs> That's a little uh, mascot that I've always carried. Yeah, ever since I was a boy, so high. I must uh, take your name and address. Absurd to make a fuss about a little thing like this. This gentleman's an old friend of mine and my husband's. I can vouch for him. Thank you, thank you. Uh, yes. <laughs> Sorry, sir. I cannot find your chauffeur anywhere. Well, never mind. Call me a taxi. Uh, 34 Rue de la Porte. Yes, sir. For heaven's sake, tell me. I only want the truth. Did you steal those pearls? Oh, I can't believe it. Why don't you believe the story I told you? If I have proof, I'll believe it. I'd rather you believed me without proof. You're asking a lot of a man, this man. It means a lot to a girl, this girl. But think what's happened, that you share in my position. You can throw me out. That's not my way. I made you a promise. Foolishly, but I made it. You leave here at twelve. I leave for the office at nine. I shall not, therefore, see you again. Good night. I'm glad to have been of service. Good night. Good night. My pajamas. Do you think I stole those too? Would you like them back again? <laughs> Please. Good night. Is there anything you wish? Your shoes. Your... Good night. Wait. I want to say something. Please. 
I know it's all been very terrible for you, but I am glad, very glad. Think that over. You like thinking, don't you? Good night. Her, all right. Don't I know it? Communicate to her parents. Mm. We know. Yeah. What is it? What? Oh, good. Good. Spare no expense. Send her back here immediately. Yes. yes. Good night. Tell me the woman's a thief. She stole the pearls from Madame Duchesne. There was no theft. 
Madame Duchesne found them. What? Undressing. They had uh, slipped. She stole my dress. Where is it now? Where I left it. Where you left it? Hmm. She stole my fiancé. Well, that's not a crime. That's a woman's business. I... I... Oh, can't I do anything to her? Hmm. Why, that's the girl. The missing bride. I know where she is. Do I get the reward? Too late. This man's already claimed it. I expect they're taking her back now. No. Yes? Two gentlemen waiting to see you. To see me? Yes. Oh, very well. I'll, I'll be ready in a moment. All right. Mademoiselle Marquin, your father and mother are deeply distressed. We must ask you to come with us. Who gave me away? I'm afraid we can't tell you, madam. Who gave you my address? Who could have given you my address? Mademoiselle, we can't tell you. We must ask you to accompany us. Of course, we can't force you. No, no, I'll, I'll come with you. I don't care now. I feel just like it. I won't keep you a minute. The train leaves at eight. There's no need to hurry. Oh, but there is need to hurry. I want to get out of here as quickly as I can. I'm ready. Hello. The door's locked. What? The door's locked, sir. All right. Don't, don't wake the lady. She's gone. She's gone, sir. Gone? G gone where? Two men came, sir. Detectives, I think. She went with them to catch a train. Train? She's the missing bride, sir. It's in all the papers. They say there's a... Don't stand that talking woman. Order the car. Order the car at once. I must go. The car has Get a taxi. Uh, yes, get a taxi. What's the time? Ten to eight, sir. Well, what time's the train going? Eight o'clock, sir. What? Eight o'clock, I think. Oh, here. Yeah. Well, where's the key? The key of the door. It's on your side, sir. Oh. Worthwhile. He was too rich for that. The chauffeur? The chauffeur? Oh, then, then it was he, not Mac.
Have you anything to declare? Mm. I love this woman. And you, madam? I love this man. 